Good evening, good evening. Good evening. Teacher. Hello, 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 hello. How do you feel today? Good evening, good evening. Good evening. <laughs> okay, welcome to everyone. Nice to see you again. It is a pleasure to be here. Can you hear me very well? Good huh? evening, teacher. Hola, hola, hola. Hello. Hola, hola. Hola, teacher. Así se la escucha. De veras, sí, estoy. estoy eh, Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Me está apareciendo algo acá que. I need to check up in order to be sure that everything is working properly. So, uh, just tell me if you can hear me very well, please. Por favor, me confirma. Yes, yes. Sí, sí. Muy bien. Yes. Okay, thank you. Okay, welcome back. We are ready to start. Don't forget to turn on your cameras, please. Okay, Don Jose Aleman, how do you feel today? Don Jose, Don Jose? Don Jose Aleman, can you hear me? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How do you feel today? ¿Cómo se siente hoy? I am good. Okay, I want to see you to all of you happy, you know. I, I know you've been working the whole day, but you need to enjoy the class. Bueno, sé que han trabajado todo el día, pero tenemos que este, involucrarnos en la clase, disfrutar la clase. Okay, welcome back. Okay, in order to start, um, I would like you make a review about what we studied yesterday. Okay, Katerina is the listener. Okay. Okay, let us make a review now, please. Okay, Edwin is there too. Welcome, Don Edwin Alfredo. How do you feel? How is the weather in your area? Really hot, maybe? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. I feel, I am feel a little uh, tired. A little tired. And what, what about the weather? Yes. How is the weather there? Ah, uh, very, very the warm, very hot, warm. Okay. 
is I my okay you you your fan is <laughs> yes okay perfect it's very warm okay okay perfect Paola is there too Gabriela is there just laughing every time got a smile smiling every time that is re pretty good that means that she's really happy you know every every time she's uh, smiling and that is really good for the health eso la sonrisa es muy buena para la salud relaja que más de 60 músculos de la cara more than 60 muscles of our face and when we are uh, so serious in this way, you know, we get a stress out, you know. So, let us remember what we studied yesterday, please. And tell me, what do you remember? Yesterday we 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 were study about the use the printer teacher the problem of the printer and how often when where no how often we use the printer okay. Okay, perfect. Somebody else. ¿Quién más? Okay, señores, señores, recuerden que esta ya es la última semana. Aquí es el eh, the last round. Este es, esta semana es el último round que tenemos. So, uh, I invite you to participate. Because in the next module, number three, you need to speak a little more. So I invite you to do it now, please. And if you if you can just turn on your cameras too, because it's really important to see your face in the way that you articulate every word. Okay, somebody else, uh, tell me, please, what. Do you remember about yesterday? Good evening, teacher. Tell me. Hola, hola, hola. Good evening, teacher. Tell me. Willing. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. I remember the study, the topic um, I would like to, and, and I wouldn't like to. 
Okay. Aprendimos a hacer oraciones negativas y positivas. Ok, perfecto. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Somebody else? Come on, you can do it. Hello. Okay, let us start uh, creating some sentences. Okay, give me some example using I would like, I would like. I would, I would like to hear from you. Some example, okay, tell me. Dime. Dime. Algunos ejemplos, por favor. Me teacher. Okay. Me teacher. Okay, do it. I, I would like to see the Cotepec, the Cotepec Lake. Okay. Is correct? Yes. Okay. Okay, somebody else, please. Me, teacher. Okay, do it, sir. <clears throat> I would like to become a doctor. Is correct, teacher? I would like to come to become a doctor. I would like to become become a doctor. Okay. 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 And, and, uh, I would like to learn about animal, is correct? Repeat again, please. I would like to learn, learn about animal. I would like to... Learn, learn about animal. Ah, okay, learn about animals. And then, and uh, let me see, let me see, let me see, teacher. I would like to meet the president. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Me, teacher. Oh. Okay, go ahead. Okay. I would like to drink coffee. I would like to eat my dinner. I would like to watch a movie. I would like to travel to other country. Okay, perfect. Me, teacher. 
Go ahead. Okay. I would like to be on vacation now. Okay. I could, I could like to go to the cinema. Okay, you would like to go to the cinema. Okay, somebody up, somebody up, please. Me, teacher. I would like to eat in Italy. I would like to go to the cinema to see Barbie. Okay. Somebody else? Uh, me, teacher. I would like to travel to another country. Uh, for example, um, Alabama. Okay. Me, teacher. I would like to speak another language. I would like to go to the beach. And I would like to buy a house. Okay. Okay, let us see the, let, okay, let me check up here. Uh, okay. Um, okay, I already check. Uh, Okay, thank you. I already got the um the attendance. Okay, America Elizabeth. Hello, America. Hello, America, are you there? Present teacher. Okay. Thank you, Anna Iris. Ana Iris, Blanca Esperanza. Present teacher. Okay, uh, Cecilia Maribel. Present teacher. Edwin Alexis. Edwin.
Ok. Uh, Edwin Alfredo. Present teacher. Present. Ok, welcome. Francisco. Gabriela Yamilet. Present teacher. Gisela. Press, I am here, teacher. Okay, welcome. Ingrid. Present, teacher. Jonathan. Present, teacher. Jose Ernesto. Present teacher. Jose Luis. Present. Karina. Present teacher. Okay, um, Catherine. Present. Catherine Maricela, ¿cierto? Sí. Sí. Okay. Paula Jovel. Pau, say hello, Pau. Okay. No le encendió el micrófono. Eh, Natalie. Present teacher. Okay, step two. Mauricio Antonio. Good evening, teacher. Present. Okay, uh, Roxana. Álvarez. Elizabeth Landa Verde. Present teacher. Okay, uh, Sara. Present teacher. Okay, Sara, is there too. Welcome, Sara. Janet. Present teacher. Okay, Janet is there too. Uh, Yesenia Lisset. Present teacher. Okay, yes, 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 is there too. Okay, let me see. I got three. Okay, solamente tres ausencias. Wow, así debió haber sido desde el inicio. Pero bueno, it's difficult sometimes. Okay, let us. I'm going to show you my topic for today. My goodness, I don't know what is happening with my computer. What's going on here? Okay, hold on a second, please. Okay, here we go. Okay, let me check out first. I got something present. Paula is there again. Okay. Okay, this is class number 18. And the topic that we are going to study today is how to use could for polite and formal request. How to use could for polite and formal requests. This is the topic for today. So let us start. I'm going to stop chatting here because I need to share something else. Okay, hold on a second, please. Okay, we are going to start with this activity. Let me share with you. Hold on a second, I need to open it. Okay, wait, 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 wait. wait. Come on. 
Ah, okay. Um, I guess uh, I'm going to show you and we are going to do it together. Need to get the one. Okay, let us see what I have here. This is a question. And what you are going to do is just to decide if I'm, I'm talking about request or offer. For example, this said, could you please give me a glass of water? Which uh, is the answer, A or B? Do you consider this is a request or an, an offer? Request. Is a request. Oh, okay, a request. ¿Qué, qué dice en español ahí para, para clarificar eso? Veamos. Que si podría, por favor, darle un vaso de agua. Ah, ok. Could you please give me a glass of water? Ah, vea, vea, que hablamos al inicio de que vamos a aprender a usar could en, en, de manera formal, you know? Entonces, mire cómo dice, could you please give me a glass of water? De manera professional, you know? Ok, you say is a, right? Okay, perfect. What about this one? Can I help you? It is, you see, it is a request or an offer? It's an offer. Request. Request. It's an offer. Uh -huh. I need that you clarify your mind. Can I help you? Ojo con eso, necesito que estemos claros. Él, él está ofreciendo ayuna, ayuda. Ah, entonces es una? Un offer. Uh -huh. Él está ofreciendo ayuda. Es un offer. Can I help you? Sí, puedo ayudarle. Ah, okay, ok, ok. Diferente. Okay. Ah, ok. How can I switch into a request? ¿Cómo podría yo cambiar esto a una. a, a solicitar algo? I heard you. No. Tendría que llevar una palabra antes. Cool. I could lie. Do you help me? Mm. Podría ser, pero veamos, veamos. ¿Cómo, cómo sería? ¿Qué podría ser? ¿Tú qué? ¿Help? ¿Qué palabra usamos en la anterior? I would cool. like. Ok. Cool. ¿Cómo puedo I hacerlo like. aquí? Would you help me? I could help you. I would like help me. Or I would like... Yes. Teacher, would you help me? Would you help me? Ah, ojo, ahí les dejo, vean la posición donde voy a usar. Donde voy Will a usar. I help me? Y si usted. Ah, uh, ok. Aquí sería de cambiar esto. Would you? Would you help me? Would you? Ok, veamos aquí. This is an offer. Um, let, let us see the next one. Okay, can you open the door? Is our request or an offer? Request. Can you, can you open the door? Request or offer? Dime, dime, dime. Request. Okay, perfect. Okay, what can I do for you? What can I do for you? It's an offer. Offer. Offer, teacher. Offer. Are you sure? 
Yes. Where... ¿Qué puedo hacer por ti? Sí, ¿será eso una oferta? Yes. O a request. Offer, teacher. Offer, offer. Okay, you say offer. Okay, I'm going to click offer. And that is correct. Okay, number five. Say, so could you please turn on the light? Request. ¿Qué está pidiendo ahí? Que le encienda la luz. Ah, pero vea de qué manera se lo pide. Y le dice, could you please? Que si podría, por favor. Could you please turn on mm -hmm. the light? Sí, es request. Ok, vea la estructura, por pues. favor. And the last one. How can I help? How can I help? Offer. Offer, teacher. Offer, teacher. Offer, <coughs> teacher. Ok, perfect. Let us see. Ah, you got six out of six. Okay. Okay, you already got an idea about what we are going to talk today. So we are going to start with two questions. Let me show you here. And I need that all of you talk about these questions. So let me show you here. You got it there. Let's start. And said, do you ever make a request? If so, what kind of request do you make? Two different questions. My goodness, what is happening here? I'm sorry, it was so my computer. Something really bad. Can you, can you see my screen? Yes or no, tell me, please. Hola, hola. Yes, teacher. Ah, ok, sí, porque aquí se me apagó. No sé qué pasó ahí. Ok, uh, so please give me an answer about the first question. Do you ever make a request? If so, what kind of request do you make? ¿Alguien no comprende las preguntas? Tell me, please. Tell me. Si alguien no comprende, avise, por favor. Ahora, aquí hay algo que dice, if so... Si es así, what kind of request do you make? In my job, teacher. Okay. Um, we have a, a system that um, uh, we give a request. For example, and change the position, the cashier to executive. In the system, um, I I make uh, this kind of request. Okay. Or maybe sometime when you need to yeah. resolve yeah. a problem, yes. you can um, ask to somebody else to give you a hand. Yeah. Some yeah. some days uh some days in in is necessary change the position. Oh, okay. And I make make the the request. And the system is is request request tracker. Request tracker. And I give give the 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 change and the uh, my partners 
change the position. Executive okay. or cashier. Okay. Okay, perfect. What about the rest? Tell me. Y lo demás, ¿qué pensamos? Dime. ¿Qué podría ser order food? Roxana. Order food. ¿Cómo se dice ordenar? ¿Cómo se ¿Cómo dice? Ordenar. Order food. Ordenar comida. Ah, ok. Order, order food. Okay. Order food. Uh -huh. Okay, what else? Sí, ¿quién más? Somebody else, please. Hola, hola, hola. ¿Qué pasó con los demás? Dame este weren. Hello. Okay, I'm going to stop sharing. I need that all of you participate, please. Necesito que, que todos me den una, 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 una respuesta a esas dos preguntas. Por eso al, in al inicio, I'm sorry, al inicio pregunté quién no entendía las preguntas que me dijeron. Quizá que las dijera en español para ver si... si sí, por eso, la... eso es lo que consulté. Sí. Si alguien tenía duda en algo, dije, por favor, me lo hace saber. Porque si no comprendemos la pregunta, no podemos dar una respuesta. Ok, who, who wants to... Do it. In my case, I make requests every day. Uh, I every day say to my coworker, could you bring me my documents and my reports? Okay. That's it. Thank you. Can mass. Dime, dime.
Okay, who wants to answer it? Teacher, I mean, I ask this question every day. I can, I help you. Okay. I can, I help you with something else. Okay. Teacher, and, and uh, I have an idea. And in the morning in my workplace, I I say the request uh, a main security. Could you open the door, please? Okay. It's it's good idea, teacher. Yes. Okay, thank you. Yes. It's really nice if you say in that way. Could you, could you please, could you please okay. open the door? Thank you, teacher. Okay. Okay, let us continue now, please. Okay, hold on a second. Let me see what. Okay, let, let me copy something here. We are going to open this. Teacher, hello. Yes, I made request for chimney. We asked for many things. We made equipment request. Okay. Okay, I'm going to share with you an activity and I need that you resolve this. Okay, here we go. Okay, double click and open it, please. Okay, teacher.
I feel this teacher. Hey. What about the rest? Did you finish? Hello? Tell me if you finish, please. I will not teacher. Not yet. Okay, me van avisando, por favor. Finish, teacher. Okay. Okay, let us see. Um, okay, Okay, this is number one. Okay, let us read it. <clears throat> Could you please give me a glass? Okay, it, it is the same question, right? Hold on a second. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I've got the same here. Okay. Okay, this is the one that I show you. Let, let me be sure. It... Okay, this is the one that you get, right? Okay, could you tell me what time? Which one is the right one? Is it, it, it. Could you tell me what time is it? This one or this one? The first. The first one? See. Yes. Okay, here we go. 
Okay, remember that we are going to check it uh, at the end, right? Okay, hold on a second. Yes, teacher. Is that right? No, teacher. No? No. It, it. You think it's this? Mm. What time it is? Or what time is it? Come on. I need that you decide which one is the right one. Time is running, time is running. Tengo dos posiciones. This one or this one. Teacher is it is. It is? Yes. Are you sure? Yes, teacher. Okay, let us see. Okay, let me see how can I move forward here. Do I need to check the the summit the answer for everyone? Yes or no? Would you tell me what time it is? Will you tell me what time is it? It is. Or is it? Okay, el primero me dijo is it. Luego me dijo it is. No puedo poner los dos. So. Y cada uno dice tener la razón. Okay, explain it. Before to do something for you. Porque si no, después me van a decir, no, es que usted puso eso. Yeah. Tell me. Okay, or we can check it later on, right? Okay, lo vamos a revisar después. I'm going to move it, okay. But uh, before to move, uh, let me see. How many of you think it is this one? And how many of you think it is this one? ¿Cuántos de ustedes creen que es? Is it? ¿Y cuántos creen que es? It is. Y voy a ubicar el que la mayoría diga. Come on. I need that you tell me. But hurry up, please. It is. It is. Okay. It is, teacher. Let's do it. Let's do it. It is, teacher. <laughs> okay. What about the rest? You look the mass? Solo me contestan dos, tres. Okay, I'm going to move forward. Okay, but what about this one? Could you meet that book, please? Could you face me that book, please? Or could you pass, pass me? This for me, is, is passing, teacher. Passing, passing, teacher. Could, could you passing? Passing. Could you Pass, passing me that book, please? Okay, <coughs> Could you pass me? Okay, you say pass. Okay, what about this one? Do you know what time 
the fields start or does the fields start? The field. The field start. start, teacher. The field start, teacher. Do you know what time the fields start? Okay, you say this this one, right? Bueno, recuerde que le estoy haciendo eh, le estoy haciendo lo que me van diciendo, claro. Okay. Would you mind open or opening the window? Would you mind open or opening? Tell me. Tell me, please. Would open you, teacher. Would you mind opening the window, teacher? You opening. Opening the window. Okay, what about the next one? Let me move a little bit. Okay, could you open the window? For me. Teacher, for me. For me. Which one? For me. For me. For me or to me? For, for me. For, for, for me. me, teacher. Bueno, madre. Okay, next one. Would you? My. Me. My. Would you mind having a, a look at my work? Would you? Mine. Would you mind this one life? Mine. 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 having a look of my work? Yes. Okay, you say in that way. I, I respect what you say. And the last one. Could you tell me? How far the station is, or how far is the station? How far the station is. Okay, vamos. Here we go. I'm going to submit answers. Veamos sus respuestas. Okay, I need to submit this one too. It is why. What about this one? Do you pass me the book, please? Do you know what time? Okay, let us see this one. Okay, it is why too. Uh, could you mind opening the window? Let us see. Okay. And uh, do you know which strain? This is or is this? Which one is survival? Tell me, this, this is or is this? Hello? Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, please. Rapido, rapido, rapido. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes. Uh, yes, teacher. Um, okay, choose one, is, choose one, please. Choose one. Elija una, por favor, elija una. Is this? Do you do know you which train? Is this? Uh, okay. This way? Okay, let us summit. Uh uh, uh uh. Uh, sorry. Uh uh. Okay, could you open the window for? Okay, you say for. Okay, let me check that. Okay, that is right. Would you mind having a look at my word? Okay, let us summit. Okay, that is correct too. And the result. Okay, let me show the answers. Okay, um, number one is why. Alguien que me la lea, por favor, please. Somebody wants to read it. Number one, lea me la primera, por favor. 
Me teacher. Could you tell me? Um, okay, bueno, bueno, bueno. I'm sorry. Let's second, see. second, Let's second. Let's see. Caballero, siga. Could you tell me what time is it? Okay. Gaby, next one. Number two. Could you pass me that book, please? Okay. Number three. Somebody else. Alguien más. Vamos, 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 vamos. Come on. I need all of you to participate. I told you at the beginning. Yeah. Number three, please. Okay, if you don't want to do it that way, I'm going to say names. Um, let me see. Roxana, please, could you read it? Number three. Okay, teacher. Lo puede bajar un poquito, por favor. Se le ha cortado. Okay, let me, let me move a little bit. Okay. Hi. Do you know what time the film starts? Okay, do you know, do you know what time the film no. starts? Okay. Do you know what time the film starts? Okay, ¿y qué dice ahí en español? Alguien que le dé una manito, por favor. Somebody can give a hand to her. ¿Tú conoces o tú, tú sabes? ¿A qué hora comienza la película? ¿A qué hora empieza la película? Ah, ok. Sí. Ok, thank you. Number four, I'm going to choose somebody else. Ok, let me see here. Opening the window. Ah, ya me la leo a alguien. Oh, soy Janet, léala por favor otra vez. Would you mind opening the window? Ok, así. Would you mind? Would you mind? Would you mind opening the window? Would you mind? I know somebody else. Would you mind opening the window? Okay, and the uh, pronunciation is really important when you uh, talk about the question. Would you mind opening the window? Do you mind opening the window? Okay, because in Spanish, questions are in this way. En español no tenemos, eh, bueno, no acostumbramos a hacer eh, rise intonation or falling intonation. En inglés debemos de notar mucho eso. Okay, thank you. Number five, somebody else wants to read it? Okay, ah, bueno, Sara está de oyente. Don, don José Alemán, please. Read number four. Don José Alemán, please. Active su micrófono, por favor, Don José. No quiere, no quiere ese micrófono. Por ahí está el, 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 el icono de, del micrófono, Don José. Bueno, ahí no está dando problema. Ok, later on, don't worry, don't worry. Tranquilo, don't worry. Tranquilo, ahí, ahí, ahí le va a encontrar. Ok, uh, Paola, will you read it, please? Paola is there. Are you there? No. Natalie, what about you? Ah, Paola is there. Paola is there. Okay, go ahead, Paola. What number, teacher? Number four. Would, would you mean opening the window? Ah, okay. Ahí vamos a arreglar eso. Would you mind? Repeat. Would you mind opening okay. the window? Would you mind opening the window? Would you mind opening the window? Okay, ahora me lee la número cinco, please. 
Number five, this. Read it, read it. Do you know which train is is this? Okay, remember the intonation. Do you know which train is this? Okay, thank you. Do you know which train is this? Okay, thank you. Uh, Natalie. Natalie, are you there? Natalie, está ahí. Mi teacher, perdón. Okay, solo mi teacher. Es que casi solo Kenny me dice, perdón. Okay, read number five, please. Do you know which train is this? Okay. And the answer correct is, do you know which train this is? Okay. Don't forget the intonation. Okay, let me stop and we are going to switch the activity. Vamos a cambiar la actividad. Let me see what else we have here. Okay, uh, well, I'm going to explain you this class and then vamos a, a explicar esto primero y luego muestro algo. Okay. Okay, how to make polite requests. Let me more. Okay. I'm going to read it for you. Ya leerlo, dice así. Okay, hold on a second. A request is when we ask someone for something. Then we are asking someone for help. It is important to be polite. We must avoid being too direct. Okay, hasta ahí. Alguien que me dice la primera línea hasta el punto que dice en español para quienes tienen dudas. Only one, please, solo uno, por favor. Veo muchas manos arriba. Hola, hola. Cuando le pedimos ayuda a, un, a alguien es un, algo muy importante. Ok. Una solicitud, dice, es cuando nosotros le pedimos a alguien algo. Si we are asking someone for help, desde que nosotros estamos pidiendo a alguien que nos ayude, it is important to be polite, es importante ser cortés. We must avoid being too direct. Debemos evitar ser tan directos. Here are some examples of being too direct. Aquí hay algunos ejemplos de ser demasiado directo. Okay. Alguien dice, I want to help. Pass me the soul. Can you carry my bag? Esas son directas. Luego sería bueno que las dejen por ahí escritas para cambiarlas a una forma polite later on. Okay. These questions are all correct English, but they are too direct. Estas preguntas o estas oraciones, todas están eh, de forma correcta, pero ellas son muy directas. This are not polite requests. Son solicitudes no corteses. They are, in fact, quite rude. Ellas realmente son un poco rudas. People will be offended because they will think that you are giving them order. Algunas personas posiblemente se pueden ofender porque ellos pensarán que usted lo que está haciendo es dándoles órdenes. And for that reason, we need to be careful about the way that we are going to ask 
for a request. Ok, ¿qué es lo que dice aquí en la parte de abajo? Bueno, ya habíamos leído hasta acá. Estas no son solicitudes corteses. En realidad son un poco rudas. Las personas se sentirán ofendidas porque ellos pensarán que usted les está dando orden. Ok, question. So far from here. Preguntas hasta acá. Hello. No, What? teacher. ¿Y los demás qué dicen? Y una, y una forma cortés, ¿cómo sería entonces? Ah, okay. I, want, I want help. I want help. Hay palabras. I palabras? need. Teacher, maybe Would. I need help. Would you oh, help me? Would you help me? Ok, Would eso es lo que vamos me? a hacer después. No. Eso es lo que quiero, que, que sus, mentes, eh, sus mentes comiencen a pensar en eso. I need that you think of. I already show you some examples. Ya les mostré algunos ejemplos. Ahora por eso les dije, escríbanlas por ahí y luego las hacemos. Ojo con esto, mira. Couldn't make. A term model for making polite requests is could. For example, could I please have some water? Ah, could I please? Could I please have some water? Could is the past tense of can. However, el could es la forma del pasado de can. Sin embargo, when asking for permission, cuando lo hacemos para pedir permiso, could does not have a past tense meaning. El could no tiene un significado en pasado. Could have the same meaning as may when making requests. El could tiene el mismo significado que may cuando hacemos solicitudes. ¿Sí? It is equally polite to say es igualmente corte decir could I leave early or may I leave early. Entonces aquí da igual. Y luego dice, could is used with any subject to ask for permission. El could es usado con cualquiera de los sujetos para pedir permiso. For example, could I open the window? Sí. Podría yo abrir la ventana. Or could you open the window? Entonces, mire aquí, no hay cambio. Could you open the window? Are both grammatical. Ambas están correctas. Ok. Preguntas aquí, question. If I go back, si ahora me regreso, ¿cómo podría cambiar esta de I want help? O pass me the soul, please. O can you carry my bag? Y todavía me puedo ir más atrás. Bueno, ahí teníamos algunos ejercicios que hicimos donde vimos algunos ejemplos. I show you some examples. Y hey, teacher. Ok, tell me. Can you pass me the salt, please? ¿Será que puedo usar Ken aquí para hacerlo cortés? Um, vamos a ver qué. ¿Qué decía aquí? ¿Cuál podría usar? Cool, cool. ¿Cómo sería? Could you pass me the salt, please? Ah, could you pass me the salt? The salt, please. Y en la siguiente, teacher. Hello? Uh, could you carry my bag? Could, could you carry my bag? Ah, okay. Y la primera? I could help. Mm. ¿Qué palabra va primero? Could I want help? Ojo, ojo con eso. Tal vez sería... Teacher, maybe could you help me, please? 
No, because you are offering. Usted está ofreciendo. Oh, okay, okay. Could I help you? Could I help you? Okay. Bueno, ya despejamos dudas. Okay, we use the model there can occur and good to offer to do things for people or to invite them to do something. We also use them to make requests or ask permission to do something. Usamos los modales o los verbos modales que incluyen good para ofrecer hacer algo uh, para las personas o para invitarlas a hacer algo. También lo usamos para hacer solicitudes, pedir permiso para hacer algo. Y luego dice, they are a type of auxiliary verb we use with other verbs to add more meaning to the verb. Ellos son una, un tipo de auxiliares, de verbos auxiliares que usamos con otros verbos para agregar significados a ellos. After modal verb, we use the infinitive form without to. Después de un verbo modal, usamos eh, un verbo infinitivo sin la partícula to. Ojo con eso. Y luego dice, model are not used with the auxiliary verb do. Los modales no son usados con el auxiliar do. O sea, si tengo un auxiliar, no puedo usar do. To for the negative. To for the negative, we are not after the model. To ask questions, to put the model in the front of the shop. Okay, example A. You couldn't pass me that way, could you? Oh, honesto. Can I have a taste? You couldn't pass me that way, could you? It revolution all model do not change in the third person singular for each and it in the present simple. Sophie can send for us. Okay, hagan una captura de esta información, por favor. Let me see the time that we have now. Okay, I need to explain something else. Lo vamos a hacer más práctico con ejemplos, pero guarde, ¿ya hicieron la captura? No? Yes, yes, teacher. yes, yes. Okay, I see in a hurry. In a hurry, okay. It's a model seems quite easy to use. What do we use then for? Los modales parecen ser fáciles de usar. ¿Para qué los usamos? We use them for lots of different things. Los usamos para muchas cosas. And we, uh, the same model pair can have several different uses. Y los mismos verbos modales pueden tener diferentes usos. Today we are just going to look at offer, invitation, request, and permission. Aunque realmente la parte nuestra solamente ve un punto, pero aquí voy a incluir esos. Uh, offer, invitation, request, and permission. Right, fire away. I mean, you can fire away if you like. Okay, hold on a second. Let me see here. Okay. Oh, you are giving me permission. Thank you. We use good plus like a lot of offer. It's very useful for different situations. Example, would you like to come to our house for dinner? En español que dice ahí, eso ya lo vimos. Hola. Would you like to come to our house for dinner? En español, en español. ¿Te gustaría venir a mi casa a cenar? Para cenar. Oh, ok, es. Está haciéndole el qué cosa. Está ofreciendo o está haciendo una solicitud. Ofreciendo. Ok, next one. Would you like some cake? Would you like some cake? Would you like to celebrate Chinese New Year's with us? ¿Le gustaría celebrar el nuevo año chino con nosotros? 
Ahora, la parte de abajo no la vamos a ver porque ahí dice, for more informal invitation, you can use can plus get. Get mean by uh, in this context. Ok, esa parte como es informal no la vemos. Ahí se la dejo para que ustedes lo puedan tener. Eh, ok, let me see what else. Ok, bueno, aquí vamos a parar esto porque aquí necesito más la parte del material. Ok, let me see the time. Ok, I guess it's going to be better. Ok, uh, let me see if you can see well. Um, ok, hold on a second. Let me check out the chat. I got the... Uh, ah, you got some answer there. Ok, let us see this one. I don't know if you can see it now. Yes. Ok, hold on a second. Let me see where it is. The place that we need to study. Ok, here we go. Uh, we have a conversation here. I need that you listen carefully, Hi. listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then Hi, practice yes, with yes, the practice. Can you hear me very, very, very well? Yes? Yes, yes teacher. teacher. Very well. Okay, thank you. Uh, I'm going to mute all the microphones in order that avoid any interference here. Okay, Max is there. Okay, that is me. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for pips.com. We received a new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Could you hold on a second, please? Aquí aparece una de las expresiones que yo he venido usando con ustedes. Could you hold on a second, please? ¿Qué significa eso de hold on? Hold on. And I, I use it and I say hold on a second, please. Or hold on a minute. Please. Eh, espérenme, esperen un momento. Ah, okay, okay, muy bien. Uh, it's an multi-pace mix study, MX study. They are talking about uh, the model. Okay, first, make sure that the power curve is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Ojo, vea como le dice. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Podría decirme qué es lo que necesito hacer después, por favor? Y le dice Max. Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appear on the screen, click on complete install. Okay, preguntas, preguntas sobre pronunciaciones. Dime. Fluget, teacher. Excuse me? Fluid. What is it? Ah. <laughs> all right. All, all right. No, 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 no. Arriba estaba. Me equivoqué. Mm. Max, Fluid. teacher. Max. Okay. First, make sure that that the power core is. Plug it in. Creo que esa es. Yes. Okay, where it is? I'm going to read again. This is you. Voy a leerlo una vez más.
Oke, okay, all time second please. Oke, okay, and right here also I'm seeing maybe right here is missing a letter. Right here. I don't know why, but how to do multi-page. And right here is say an multi-page. So sería lo más adecuado que dijera multi-page. Y tendría que cambiar incluso aquí el, 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 el determinante o el artículo, ¿no? Valga la aclaración. Ok, I'm going to read again. again. Say, hello, this is Mac from Tech Support. How can I help you? I'm Max. My name is Joe. I work for, for pics.com. I don't know why they put... Uh, a question mark here. Uh, we received a new printer and I need help setting up. Could you help me please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me see. Can you hold on a second, please? Uh, it's a uh, multi-page MX30. I tendría que cambiar. It's a multi. Okay, okay, first, make sure that the new power cord is plugged in. All right, it, it, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appear on the screen, click on complete install. Okay, preguntas before we go to practice. O algún significado de alguna frase que no comprenda, por favor me la dice para ayudarle. Plug in, plug in. Toda la expresión ahí dice, ok, first, primero asegúrese de que el cable de energía de poder o de lo que sea esté conectado, el cable que lleva la impresora. ¿Sí? Eso sí, eso quiere decir ahí, plug in, plug in, que esté conectado. The power cord es el cable, es el cable. El cable de poder. Ok, ¿qué más? ¿Qué más? Tell me, dime, dime, dime. Pisa multiplay. ¿Qué significa, teacher? Which is, one? Is, is a multiplay. A multipage. Correcto, sí. Ok, en este caso... Eh, son impresoras que pueden sacar eh, ¿qué? 30 páginas por minuto. De eso depende. Ok, what else? ¿Qué más? Installation CD, el CD de instalación. ¿Qué dijo que era setting it up, teacher? Ok, let me see what it is. Setting it up. This one? Yes, yes. Esto viene a ser como configurar la, la, la impresora. ¿Sí? Ok, thank you. Eso es set it, setting it up. You need to install the drivers. 
and all the components. Okay, what else? Come on. Any question? Bueno, veo que no. No, teacher. Nadie pregunta nada. No, teacher. Ok, veamos. Uh, ok. Take a screenshot because you are going to need it, because you are going to practice this conversation with somebody else. Ok, si hay dudas, por favor, ahorita, no a la hora de estar haciendo la conversación. Okay. Teacher, no sé si me repite cómo se decía multipage. Multipage. Ajá, eso, perdón. Multipage. Sí. Multipage. Y, MX y el siguiente. 30. ¿Cómo? MX30. Ah, ok, ok. Thank you. Ok, recuerde que ese es un modelo. Ok, I'm going to stop sharing. Vamos a parar de compartir. Y ahora vamos a crear los breakout room. Pero les pido de favor que me ayuden porque algunos no se conectan. Ahorita tengo de oyente a Don Jonathan. Tengo a Roxana. Voy a tratar de dejar los puntos por si no se pueden conectar ellos. Veamos. Bueno, esta conversación es más larga, vamos a dejarle más tiempo. Si la terminan, eh, traten de intercambiar los papeles, por favor. Ok. Here we go. Aquí vamos. Please accept my invitation. Okay. Teacher, ¿me podría enviar nuevamente la invitación? Sí, permítame, solo estoy moviendo 
Ah, ok, ok. Algunos okay. que están solos. Ok, dicho. Estoy armando las paredes. Janet, Janet, la cambié. Ok, por ahí le envié a don Jonathan. Don Jonathan, por ahí le envié. Ok, don Jonathan, le asigné a alguien más, pero no se conectó. Ok, ok, teacher, no problem. But I'm here. Ok. I can work with you. I don't know if you have the conversation with you. Ok, teacher. Si ¿Sí tiene la conversación. Sí, sí, sí. I'm going to start. Uh, ok. You are going to be Joe. I'm going to be Max. Ok, teacher. Okay. Well, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joy. I work for Pixcam. We will save the new printer. And I need help setting up. Could you help me, please? Okay, Aki. We receive. We receive. We receive. We receive. We receive. Okay. We receive. Okay, no problem. Yo, could you tell me the model? Let, let me check. Can you hold all the second, please? Oh, it's a multiplace. MX. MX 30. 30, okay. Okay, uh, first make sure that the power card is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Okay, you said, yeah, all right. All right, all, all, right. all right. It is. All right, Aquí it no is. suena la L. Solo dice, could you? All right, could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Okay, thank you, Shay. Check uh second check that the installation CD is in the tray. And here, once the menu appear on the screen, click on com uh click on complete install. Click on complete install. Okay, estamos don Jonathan. Okay, teacher. Okay.
Sorry. Hola. Creo que no está. Hola, hola. Hello, I'm here. Okay, here we go. I need that at the moment that you are going to perform this conversation, please turn on your cameras, please. At least in the moment that you can see each other. So uh, I'm going to choose because uh, uh, what I want is that all of you participate. At least I'm not going to mention the people that is uh, uh, as a listener. No way I'm not a listener because it's time to pause. But the rest, I, I'm going to do it. Okay, let us start with uh, Maurice Antonio and your partner, please. Mauricio, are you there? Yes. Hello, Mauricio. Are you there, Mauricio? Sí, teacher. Estoy de oyente, teacher. Ah, well, okay. Excuse but... me. Okay, uh, no, don't forget to put the, that there. No se les olvide ponerle ahí listener para así no interferir. Aunque me avise. Ah, al final del nombre lo tiene, teacher. Ah, pues sí, no se ve, no se ve. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, um, let me see somebody out here. Wow, aquí tengo otro listener, 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 listener. My goodness, a lot of people. Incluso Sara is a listener too. Okay, let us start with uh, America. 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 Teacher, temprano le puse aquí por motivos de salud y no estar solo de oyente. Ah, ok, ok. Sorry, teacher. Uh, let us see, Gisela. Yes, teacher. Ok, with your partner, please. Con su compañero, por favor, o compañera. <laughs> America. Ah, oh, my goodness, America is... It's kind of six, got so strong. Okay, I'm going to ask to Jonathan uh, in order that we're with you because of the moment that I create the breakout room, anybody connect with him. Le voy a pedir a don Jonathan que pueda uh, trabajar con usted ya que al momento de crear el breakout room, nadie se conectó con él. Y tuve, ah, okay. tuve que hacerlo. En, eh, yo le ayudé a él. So, uh, I don't know if you can work together now. Okay, don't worry. Eh, solo que no sé si okay. puedo compartirla acá o, o porque tendría que salirme para ver la del screenshot. I'm going to share it. I'm going to share it here. Okay, okay you got it there. Don Jonathan, are you there? Hello, teacher. I do. Okay, uh, you are going to <clears throat> let me see. Okay, lady. Lady, could you could you tell me if you want to be Max or Joe? Don't worry, Max. Uh, Max okay, uh, I Joe. Okay, okay. Hello, this is Max from Tech Super. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for Pex.com. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joey. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's an Ultipage MX30. Okay, first. Make sure that the power curve is plugging it. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the isolation CD in in the ray in the tray, and third, once the menu appears on the screen, click 
on the complete installer. Perfect. Click on Thank you. Install. Click on complete install. Change the role, teacher, or another? Is the program you change the role? Okay, if you want to do it, go ahead, do it now. Okay, Jonathan, you, you, yo, I am Max. <laughs> okay. okay. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joey. I work for PicCam. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joy. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's a multiplayer and exterior. Okay. First, make sure that the power core is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click the complete install. Thank you. Okay, thank <laughs> you. Somebody, somebody uh, across the time, I need only just one, one couple more, and maybe tomorrow uh, somebody else can continue. But right now, only just one couple more. Me teacher with my partner. <coughs> okay, go ahead, go ahead, go, go ahead. Paola. <coughs> Sorry. Okay, don't worry, sure, sure. Oh, your, your microphone, please. Okay, vamos. Um, <coughs> yo soy Max, ¿verdad? Yes. He Hello, this is Max from the test support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for Pitscom. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, <laughs> it's on multi-page and X30. Okay, first, make sure that the power core is plugging. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that installation CD is in the in the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click on complete install. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. I'm going to stop sharing here. And later on, you are going to have the opportunity to, to continue doing this conversation because of the time because we are so close to finish. Let me move a little bit by here my material. Uh, the activity number three, so I figured it out, uh, fill in the plan, use the conversation mode to help yourself. Number one, you tell me what the model is. What is the missing word right here? The palabra se falta ahí. You describe the problem, please. ¿Qué palabra falta acá? Vulture. Vul. Come on, tell me. Dime, dime. Could you tell me what the modeling is? How could you tell me? Could. I, acuérdense que la L, la L no suena. Could you? And, could you tell me? Sí, o good you tampoco. No, no, could suena, you tell me? no suena la L. Mm -hmm. Sí. Mm -hmm. Ok, ahora veamos acá si en una forma rápida. How to use could for polite and formal requests. A structure. Aquí está la estructura. Could plus the subject plus verb, the paper. 
plus the complement and the question mark. It's a similar structure. Example, could you write this report, please? Cuando le pida a alguien que le haga un reporte, usted use, could you write this report, please? Or an example could be, could you deliver this letter today, please? And how to use can for informal requests. Bueno, aquí aparece una forma informal. Uh, can is used uh, to ask informal requests. Lo usamos para hacer eh, solicitudes informales. Can plus the software plus fair pay for plus the company. Example, uh, can you write this report, please? Esto serían de manera informal. Can you help deliver this letter today, please? Y ahí en la cuadra le pide que usted escriba cinco requests that your boss could ask you next week. Cinco solicitudes que su jefe puede pedirle la próxima semana. Vamos a cerrar quizás justamente aquí. Uh, well, I'm going to give you uh, three minutes in order that you write two. En tres minutos me escriben dos requests. Veamos. Escribe a door request your, that your boss could ask you next week. Que su jefe le puede pedir la próxima semana. Please. Teacher. Okay, Gabi, tell me. Could you start to work at 6 a.m.? And could you work with other co worker Okay. Edwin, Edwin. Me, teacher. Thank okay. you, Gabi. Uh, the first, could you send me the weekly reports, please? Okay. Okay, I'm going to stop chatting here. I need to see your faces here. Okay. In the other, could you answer me the email, please? Okay, remember that you are not going to pronounce the letter L. Recuerde que la letra L no la vamos a pronunciar. Could. Ah, could, could. Yes. Eso sucede en could, en good, incluso en el verbo, es, el caminar es walk, no walk. 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 Ah, okay. Could. Yes. Okay. Okay, thank you. Somebody else. ¿Quién más? Me, teacher. Okay, Jonathan. Could you lend me your lunch? Could you? Um, could you let me your lunch? <laughs> I guess it's gonna be better uh, if you say, "Could could you share your 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 lunch with me, please?" <laughs> <laughs> and the second, could you wait a moment, please? Ah, okay. Will you wait for this? Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay. <clears throat> okay, thank you. Somebody else. Somebody else. Quien más? Quien más? Rapidito. Come on, come on. You can do it. I know you can do it.
Bueno, nadie, nadie, nadie. Vamos a revisar la asistencia. Bueno, uh, también invitarles a que vayamos realizando las actividades que nos hacen parte en la plataforma, por favor, para poder actualizar esas notas justamente el lunes en la noche. Ya el martes a las 8 de la mañana eso debe estar actualizado. Entonces, uh, me gusta ser puntual con la entrega de las calificaciones. Eh, y ya para el día martes a las 8 que me revisen eso ya debe estar ahí. Así es que le pido de favor que sea puntual en la entrega para poder presentar mi informe en el debido tiempo. Por favor. Teacher. Hello. O sea que la última clase la vamos a tener el lunes. Yes. Ok, teacher. Ahí cerramos. Ya solo nos queda la clase del día de mañana y el día lunes hacemos el review. Y ese mismo día lunes hacemos la encuesta también. Ok, ok. Y montos terminado. Parece que fue ayer que comenzamos. Y mira, ya vamos avanzando. Y los que se quedaron y dijeron, no, ya no, muy difícil. Ahí se van a quedar esperando. Y ustedes van hacia adelante. Y eso así es, así es. Y como dijo el colombiano, vamos para arriba, es para arriba, es para arriba. ¿Sí? Bueno, alegrense, deben de estar contentos que ya van a finalizar un nivel más. Pero, sí. Yes, teacher, yes. No le veo. Yes, teacher. Be, I don't know why. I am very okay. happy. Yes, Every teacher. Time you are getting a one step. Cada vez van avanzando un paso, un paso, un paso. Y cuando menos acuerdes, ha llegado al final. Y eso es lo importante. El tiempo pasa, señores. Y el deseo de superación queda por ahí. Y vea, no hay edad para poder superarse. Y se lo dice alguien que <coughs> está probando eso. He estado en una carrera que he tenido hasta mis alumnos de compañeros. Y ahí voy. Y gracias a Dios ya terminé tesis. Solo estoy justamente esperando fecha de graduación con ellos. Y nunca es tarde. Congratulations, teacher. Okay, thank you. And I invite you to do the same. Y les invito a hacer lo mismo. Yes, teacher. Bless you. Okay. Pero no quiero que me van a decir, ah, es que piense que no, porque ya en mis años. No, 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 no. El espíritu no envejece, señores. Nosotros debemos de mantenernos. Es para arriba, es para arriba. Ahí vamos. Ok, teacher. Okay, ok, ahí está Paola poniéndonos una manito. Ok, let me check out uh, again the attendance. Ok, America, America, say hello, America. Ok, bueno, ahí tiene que tomar algo. You need to see a doctor or take some medicine in order that you can feel better because uh, you have sore throat. So try to drink a uh, hot tea or something. And that way you are going to feel better. Uh, look for honey and lemon and something hot and drink it. Okay. Pero si no consigue eso, consigase un par de, de, de florcitas de esas de mulata y las hace ahí. Y hace un tecito. Le digo que como mi trabajo es precisamente pasar hablando todo el día desde las 7 de la mañana hasta las 11 de la noche... Eh, ya la experiencia me ha ayudado a poder superar ese tipo de de soul stroke ¿sí? o, o faringitis aguda eh, algunas veces cuando no es también Hola. fíjese teacher disculpe también me ha ayudado a mí el té de hojas de limón y le echa un poquito de vic es feo pero le quita rápido como que las flemas a veces uno la tiene pegada entonces eso hace el despegue de la flema Ay, ese eso... té de eso es bueno. De hojas de limón. Uh -huh. Bueno, a ver. Ese si té no... de hojas de limón con, a ver si con no un poquito de A ver si no nos censuran el vídeo, pues estar dando recetas. <risa> 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 
Teacher, que la que sea una receta pero en inglés. It's out of it's out of the class, but uh, yeah, it's better to say in English, but uh, sometimes maybe for some of you it's going to be difficult to say in that way. But if you are going to get some uh lemon uh leaves and you are going to put a little bit vaporu, okay, you can see. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> lemon, lemon and honey. Lemon. Okay, lemon and honey. Okay, okay. Bueno, sigamos con la asistencia, por favor, que ya se nos hizo el comentario. Okay, okay. Blanca Esperanza. Present teacher. Si, si no nos va a pasar por la parte de marketing. Deje imbécil. Se va. No, 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 no. I'm here. Estoy bien acá. Ok. Cecilia. Cecilia. Are you there? No. Yo estaba. Edwin. Edwin, say hello. Edwin, Alex. Present teacher. Ah, no, no. No, 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 el otro, Edwin. Ok, Edwin Alfredo. Present teacher, present. Permítame que me parece, me parece que estaba don Edwin Alexis ahí. Oyente. Yes, teacher. Ahí está, Edwin Alexis, ok, eso es importante porque si no les aparece fácil. Eh, Francisco, no. Ok, Gabriela. Present teacher. No, ya no entiende por Gabriel. Ahora solo Gabi. <laughs> ok. Uh, Gisela. I am here, teacher. Ok. Uh, Ingrid. Ingrid. Jonathan. Present, teacher. José Ernesto. Present, teacher. Don José Luis. Present. Eh, Karina. Present teacher. Okay, Catherine. Present teacher. Catherine Paola. Present teacher. Okay. Eh, Candy Natalie. Present teacher. Okay. Mauricio. Present teacher. Roxana. Present teacher. Okay, Elizabeth. Roxana Elizabeth. Present teacher. Sara. Alejandra. Janet. Present teacher. Janet. Present teacher. Okay, ese micrófono está bajito, está bajito. Yesenia. Jesse, Jesse, say hello, Jesse. Bueno, no, no respondió. Okay, thank you. Don't forget that uh, tomorrow, uh, this kind of uh, like the last class, but it's in fact it's not the last one. It's la ante penultima clase, you know, in order to finish this module too. Y luego, uh, you are going to have some weeks vacation. Miren, les salió bonito porque justamente en la vacación van a, van a estar libres. Van a poder ir a las ruedas con sus niños, and etc., etc., etc. So, I invite you to enjoy with your family, your free time. Por lo tanto, aproveche, disfrute con su familia el tiempo libre que tenga. Para que después no le diga, ay, mami, venís tarde y todavía venís a estudiar. Y de repente, ay, sí, hijo, pues yo no sigo. Come on, you can do it. Todo esfuerzo trae recompensas. Así que a veces hay que sacrificar hasta los hijos, la familia. Pero eh, cuando ya se llega a la meta, también ellos tienen que celebrar. Sí, y hay que demostrarle a los niños que también uno puede, no importando la edad para poder superarse y que ellos digan, sí, mire, mi mamá, mi papá está recibiendo clases de inglés, ya habla inglés, ok, entonces, enséñale a sus hijos, practique con ellos en la mañana, morning, good morning, sí, 
Y ahí comenzamos así. También así se aprende mucho. Bueno, ya no le sigo con el sermón. Ya no le sigo con el sermón, ya es tarde. Ok, thank you very much and I hope to see you tomorrow. Sí, sí. sí. Y ahí good night, see you tomorrow. Good night, good night, good night. Sí, la good night. La disculpa por el sermón, pero bueno, es necesario. Good night, partner and teacher. Okay, bye-bye, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Bye-bye. Okay, bye. See you, see you, bye-bye.